We talk a lot of women's fashion here on North Dakota today, but you know what? We want our guys to look good too. We have AJ Wilson with Helber Stats here in studio this morning to talk about men looking fabulous. Some men uh, love to shop and uh, keep up with the uh, latest looks, and sometimes us ladies have to do it for our, our men too. True. Yep. So welcome to the show. I know you brought a model. We're gonna yeah, talk about his us. outfit in a minute here, but uh, first in the break we were talking. I'm like, okay, so are there like trendy things that happen with men? You said. That's more of a, a women's fashion thing, and we're not going to be talking about animal prints necessarily. For no, guys. Not necessarily. Uh, you can incorporate a fun print or two, but most guys, I mean, unless you're very fashion forward, are looking to go, oh, a texture or a fun, you know, neutral pattern like some of the things we brought. So we're going to discuss because we're uh, the change of the seasons. We've kind of yes. gone from t shirts <laughs> and shorts to now it's cooler out, and, and men need to change their uh, look when. The weather gets cooler too. Correct. So, kind of, what are we? Can we start with you? Can we start yes, with what course. you're wearing? Yep, this is a new line that we picked up this season. Uh, Dibby, it's awesome. They do um, fun cardigans, fun sweaters, fun layering pieces, which are kind of what I placed under a bunch of these guys here. Uh, and it's just nice to be able to put something with a cool texture, a little bit of layering. So, if you don't have to throw on a North Face, you know, every yeah. time you go out, you can do a fun layering piece, dress it up with a bow tie no tie, throw it on with jeans, throw it on with dress slack. So you can do a lot of different things with it. Yeah, dressy or casual. Because it looks good with, with the jeans, how you're wearing it yeah. right now, too. Yeah. I love it. And, like, how warm is it? So, I mean, some men, I love the layered look, but sometimes they feel like if they have an undershirt and a shirt, and a, it can get be too much. Is this, are you really warm in here today? It can be a little cumbersome to have on multi-layers, but, like, if you're doing this kind of combination, you don't necessarily need an outerwear coat. Uh, you know, if you're wearing it in the office or maybe going outside or family photos are a big thing you yes, know, for a lot right of guys. Mm -hmm. uh, just layering up and being able to do different looks. And you could do this, unbuttoned, pair of jeans, t-shirt, run to Target in it, take the kids out, you know, something easy. The color is beautiful. Is this a, a popular color right now? Yeah, green is definitely something that men really gravitate towards because it's such a easy neutral. You know, pairs well with a good blue jean, throw it on with a nice dress slack. Um, so it's just nice and easy to pair with, complements kind of everything. Okay, let's move on to some of the other pieces. Uh, can we stick with the sweaters before we move on? Yes, here? of what course. Do you, what do you have here? So kind of like our model here, Cody, uh, you have a couple of just different layering pieces. Uh, so many guys are like, what's something easy I can throw on with multiple layered shirts underneath? Um, simple shirt, simple sweater, same the D uh, Dibby brand. We have four different colors in this. There's the green, the oatmeal. Cody has on the blue, and then we have a gray as well. And I think, although I, I'm really drawn to the green you're wearing, some guys might feel a little safer in the blue. Oh, 100%, and that was intentional. That's why okay. I wore, you know, kind of the flashier color, still show that we have something a little fun, but then you do have a good neutral, you know, some safer options. And then if you want to throw a pattern shirt underneath it, or just, like I said, a simple T-shirt, makes it really easy to layer up. I like this. What, that's kind of looks like jean material. I'm yeah, it's sure. just kind of like a cottony chambray, uh, really fun t-shirt. Like I said, you can throw this on with jeans, throw it on with khakis, and you know, being able to layer up like this, if you get hot, take one layer off and you still have a cool, cool vibe or throw the sweater on if you're going out or you know, more, maybe a casual meeting. So there's quite a few different things you can do with it. And this is a really popular look here too with the jacket. Super classic. We have kind of gone pretty heavy with sport coats and then just a good layering shirt. You get a lot of guys that are like, you know, I want something cool, but I don't want it to be too fussy. So get a really awesome pattern coat in a neutral color, easy to wear with, again, a pair of jeans, dress it up with a tie and slacks, or you can do so many different layering pieces with super casual or super dressy. And let's talk about Helberstats itself, because you I, I love that you just said some guys don't want to be too fancy, yep. fussy, you know, every um, you're there to work with them. Make sure they have a shirt that, that fits right and a piece that they'll feel comfortable in, not yes. just their what their wife wants. hundred percent. Yeah, they'll come in and some guys know I want this shirt, I want this suit or this whatever it is. And some guys will come in saying, I have family photos and my spouse said, Hey, go get something that can go with a lot of things. And that's what's great about a lot of our pieces is we buy our products so it's not just for summer or just for winter. A lot of our pieces are year round. Obviously not so much a thicker sweater, but that's why we have such cool pattern coats. Throw it on with a simple shirt Easy to wear to a party, easy to wear to work. And we're just moving into the cooler weather. We're complaining that it's so cool this early in October, but these pieces would all work from October through March, April? Well, and almost? being North Dakota is such a fussy weather yeah. <laughs> um, area. Yeah, like I said, starting right now, 
throw on a layered piece like what Cody has on, do it with jeans, do it casual, do it dressy, and you don't need to necessarily, like I said, throw on that coat that people are so used to just throwing on to go out to wherever they're going. Uh, let's talk a little bit about your locations then, too, mm -hmm. because you said, is Bismarck, the Bismarck store, new? We just expanded into Bismarck uh, not too long ago, and that's been really awesome for us just because there's not a huge men's market out there for stores. I mean, you can go into you know, your standard smaller stores, but it's nice for that area, that neck of the woods, to be able to say, oh, yeah, I can go get a nice shirt, a good tie, a full suit at a really good reasonable price. Uh, so that's been really successful for us. And you just expanded in West Acres. We did. We went from about 5,000 square feet to 12,000. <laughs> it's a huge, huge expansion. So tons of coats, tons of shirts, uh, from dressy to casual, polos, uh, shoelaces, it, like anything a man could need, we have it. I love it. And so downtown, West Acres, kind of expand on that too then. It's man friendly because some stores men go into and they're like a little overwhelmed. Yes, but very what much. What do you do to make your store different uh, as far as making guys feel comfortable? When a guy walks in, I mean, it's not as easy as when a girl walks into a store and she maybe is like, I want the whole store. <laughs> and with a guy, they kind of come in and they're like, I don't need anything. I'm just looking. But you talk to him kind of how you would talk to your friend and you treat them that way also. And so you're like, what event do you have coming up? Or, oh, I heard you talking to your wife on the phone. You have family photos? Here's some great layering pieces. And then it just it builds that really nice rapport with everyone. And we want them to leave feeling like, yeah, I just went to go see my buddy at Halberstadt's. And then it makes for a really nice return. Because we do see a lot of our customers come back and ask for name specific employees and say, oh yeah, I'm looking for you know, so-and-so, is he here? He helped me with this item last time, and it was awesome. It's so that's the experience we that, want to have. That trust. Yes, exactly. That's awesome. Well, AJ, thank you so much for yes. coming in today and, and for modeling as well. We can. Uh, we need to talk about men's fashion just as much as the ladies. Have us on anytime. We want you to look good, too. <laughs> All right, thank you. We'll be right back.